What is up guys, PCHD here, and today we have got another episode of FIFA Monopoly. You can see we're rolling the first dice already. We managed to advance straight away, roll a one and a one, making that two. And we got a random card of my own choice, which means I can go and pick up an Inny Esther. If you're looking to buy coins, go and check out HDFUTCoins.com. You can use Beach, B W C H to get yourself a 5% discount on Xbox, PlayStation, and PC coins. You can see there we spent 72,000 coins on Inny Esther, played a bunch of games, to be honest. It was a bit meh, he didn't really do too much, I'm a bit of a pace abuser, as you should know by now. So, um, you know, Inniest doesn't exactly have much pace, does he, let's be honest. He scores a nice little cracker here, though, with his right foot, straight to the bottom corner, very pinnacle, straight, and, uh, you know, I was pretty pleased. From there, we're going to roll a 7, and that means I land on the random chest box chance thingy majiggy. So, we get another random player of my choice, this is going quite well for me. Saldado is who I managed to go and pick in this squad next. You know, he grabbed me five goals, four assists in his six games. I was pleased. And, you know, his goals were a bit mixed. You know, I find it quite hard, to be honest with you, at the start to get him to score goals. But once I, like, found out how to, he was going goal after goal after goal after goal, which is perfect. All his shots were pretty similar, you know, straight. You know, the keeper's left-hand side, always to the top corner, you know, always flying in. Very pleased with how he was playing. Considering I haven't actually used him that much either. So it was good enough for me. I was pretty pleased. And, you know, another lovely shot. All these shots are going straight past the keeper. No chance of saving him. We go and land on this purple card now, which is a 60 to 64 rated card I can go and add into my squad. It would be great, guys, as well. We can try and smash 300 likes on this video. That'd be amazing. Let's see. Chiku Flores is who we've added in for 200 coins. 73 pace on him. 55 shot. 58 passing. You know. I tried to pick as many pace abuse as possible for this team because Spain aren't exactly quick, are they? We go and land on a 75 to 79 rated card now, which means I'm going to go and add a pretty decent little player in. He's going to be the left midfielder, and you can see it's going to be Jesse Rodriguez, the new upgraded card. 31,000 coins for him. Managed to grab me two goals and one assist in his six games, which I guess isn't an amazing record, but he does play quite defensively, you know, low back. He's got a nice little pace. You can see me using his pace to my advantage there to whip that one into the top corner. And we move on to his second goal as well. He's, you know, again, he's kind of running past the defence. And a lovely shot with his right foot to the top corner there as well. You know, he try and use his pace wherever possible in this squad. We roll the dice again. And what are we going to land on? Two minutes. Uh, let's see. We got another purple, which is another 60 to 64 rated card. What are we going to add in? We're going to add in our right back, which is Christian, who's got 87 pace. And I was, I was pleased with that. You know, a decent, quick right back. You know, a, across the whole defence, we had, actually had a quick person. Uh, then we move on to the next roll of the die. We land on the orange 65 to 69 rated card. Who am I going to go and add in? We'll take a look now. Let's see. The left back is who we're going to go and get. And it's Castellano, who was 300 coins, 82 pace, 68 defending, 62 heading. Again, don't really notice him too much. It's just, you know, a left back. You don't really see them advance much in this formation. But a four is next on the dice. We're going to go and land on this green 80 24 rated card so you can get another decent player. We go and get Negredo's upgraded striker card. 5,100 coins at the time. Grabbed me four goals in his six games. And to be honest with you, I don't even find him that amazing. You know, he scores a very nice little goal there from a, a weird little position. But other than that, he's just. He's just so average, he's slow, his shot isn't amazing, if you get power behind it then it's good, but other than that, you know, he's just, you know, an average player to be honest with you, I'm not a huge fan, to be honest. Uh, we'll move on straight after his final goal, it's going to look like a little chip, cheeky chip, just slightly around the keeper, over the keeper. We move on to the next roll, it's going to be a number 9 we roll, and that means we land on, let's see... Another bronze, which is a 40 to 54 rated card, it should be. And then we have a 51 rated Fernandez, who was 200 coins. Again, 53 pace, so straight away discard if this card's good. He's got 53 pace, no chance. And we'll move on to the next one. <laughs> you see, what are we going to go and pick up now? We've gone and landed on a 60 to 64 rated card. And there's only really the defence left, to be honest with you. We go trios. Was 350 coins, 73 pace on him, 61 defending and 74 heading. Didn't grab me any goals or anything for a centre back, which I guess isn't too great. But again, he's only bronze playing against gold players. Next, the roll of the dice is going to be a red 70 to 74 rated card. So we can go get a silver. And what are we going to put? He's going to be the goalkeeper who's going to have a silver, an informed silver, in fact. Esteban, who was 25,000 coins, took it was a nightmare to try and sell. But uh, he was a fairly solid keeper. You know, I didn't actually concede too many goals with this team. I'd probably recommend him. You know. 
Go and check him out, try and give him a try, he's on 25k. And the final card is going to be a random one of my choice. You already know who it is, you should have seen him on your screen by now. You see, it's going to be Sergio Ramos, who was 20,000 coins. Very good player, 80 pace, got good defending, good heading stats. And other than that, that is pretty much it, guys. Do hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, remember to drop a like, 300 likes would be amazing. Subscribe to me if you aren't already, and I'll see you on the next video, guys. Bye-bye.